though. Don't come at me like that. I'm not giving you any snacks, buddy. That's right. I'm a wild animal too and I'm hungry. Oh. Okay, you win. <laughs> Cool. I'm going into the Yosemite wilderness. Going over Donahue Pass right now. Sweet. This is really cool, man. I'm gonna sit down, finish my coffee, and have a snack. Hello, Yosemite. And incredibly well <laughs> laid trail. <laughs> I'm in Yosemite and I feel the best I felt in so long. Oh man, this is great. It's gonna be a great day. I'm very excited about it. I slept in a little bit but not a lot of it. <laughs> That's for you Ricky. I just talked to a day hiker. Man, that's pretty. They said the store's open, post office open, grill closed. But what kind of gas station, gas station food am I going to get? Gas station food. Just got my feet soaked. We're already basically wet anyway, just from the snow, you know? So, I mean, I started rock hopping across that thing, and then one foot got wet, and I was like, what else? Awesome, right? Wait for this. Hello. Deep bluish pool of water on a river <laughs> yes I will I love a good log crossing Tuolumne Meadows 5.6 do 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 Wilderness, by definition, is an unpredictable and even hazardous place. So I found the informational sign. <laughs> That's the Limbert Dome. It was formed by glaciers. And apparently, they have colored Tuolumne. I'm sure I'm saying that wrong. Meadows many times over the years. And at one point... If I'd been standing here, I think it said 10,000 years ago, I'll have to back check that, but they said we'd be standing under 2,000 feet of ice. Right? Imagine all the pressure. It's how all this stuff, man, everything looks so awesome. Anyway, I'm off. My tummy hurts because I ate too many things at the gas station. Again. I was overdo it. Oh my gosh. Baptism in nature's warm heart. This is the most spacious and delightful high pleasure ground I've seen yet. And though lying high in the sky, the surrounding mountains are so much higher. One feels protected as if in a grand hall. 
This is Soda Spring. Apparently it's a major attraction. <laughs> Can I drink the water? For thousands of years, animals and people have. Small carbonated mineral springs. They're a mystery. Even geologists cannot explain why they are here, although the bubbling water comes out of the ground pure and clean. There's a possibility. Still filter it. Let's just see. Well, oh, it's really bubbling. It's kind of cool, I guess. Wow, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Can't resist a good bridge. Uh -huh. This is Colony Falls. Sweet rainbow, right? Um. Oh, and I saw this guy, Chip Crusher, that I know from the CDT, and this other guy, Gasket, that I know from the CDD, CDT, too. Well, I don't really know him, but I know of him. Now I know him, I guess. He was pretty nice. <laughs> Funny guy. Also from Florida, and we got to talk about paddling the Swanee, which was pretty cool. He had some good info. Anyway, I did like 20... I think I did like 23 today. I'm trying to take it easy. Tomorrow I'm gonna do 25. And I'm gonna do 25 the next day. And then I'll only have 15 to get to Kennedy Meadows. I'm gonna go get a shower, do my laundry, probably tent, I guess, and then make my way to Tahoe.